mean before? About the wrong direction? Hmm. I've been thinking about all the things I missed out on. When I should have been focused on you. What you need. Which is nothing. Not from you, anyway. I just want to get to know Ethan a bit. I haven't handled this well at all, have I? And straight back to being about you. Aren't Vic supposed to be good at this stuff? We're only human. <sighs> Sounds like a cop-out to me. It's true, though. For all have sinned and fallen short Bible of Bible quotes? Really? <sighs> Fine. I'll shut up and let you ask me whatever you want. Why does Manpreet think she can tell me to stay away from my brother? <laughs> what? And you. But it's Ethan I'm bothered about. I, I don't think Oh, she, she did. There must be a misunderstanding. No. Let's get this straight. I don't lie. And I don't like being accused of it either. OK, calm down. <laughs> and I hate being patronised. All I'm saying is... Well, ask what... her. Don't ask her what she said if you've got the guts. Yeah, yeah, fine. Believe what you want to believe. Look, let's go talk to her. What? No, no chance. I'm done with her. Don't ignore me. This isn't getting us anywhere. Tell father you are. You massively let me down and you act like nothing's wrong. Well, guess what? I don't need that in my life. And I don't need you. Naomi? Oh, my God, Charles! What's she done? Call an ambulance, please. Please, wake up. Wake up, please! Yeah, ambulance, please. Charles. No, this is the second time I've called. No, I want to know where my taxi is. Well, you're gonna... Never mind. Can you hear me, my love? They're here. Um, he has a weak pulse. He's been unconscious about 20 minutes. A head wound at GCS3. Thanks. And you are? I'm his partner. I'm also a doctor. Um, his name's Charles Anderson, 49. Um, no underlying conditions. And I really need him to live. Oh, I can't deal with her right now. I just want to know if he's OK. Get out! Wait outside. He was fine when I left. Like hell he was. Are you accusing me of something? What do you think? 